What did we learn in college football this weekend? <laughs> Ryan Ray here, War Room Media. Thank you for tuning in. Okay, so let's get into it. What did we learn? The first thing we learned is Texas still sucks. They're not back. They're probably never going to be back anytime soon. They have the SEC coming up in a few years. I think they'll get in sooner. Whatever. They're not back. Can we just say that? They're not back. Please don't tell me about Texas being back ever again until they've done something other than beat Louisiana Lafayette, who is not that good anyways. The problem was is that folks thought that Louisiana Lafayette was a viable, I don't know, playoff contender, but a viable top 15, top 20 program this year. And they're just not. They're just not. They're, you know, flashing a pan. So that's the first thing. The second thing we learned is Illinois is still Illinois. Brett Bielema is still Brett Bielema. <laughs> you know? oh, Nebraska and Scott Frost, good night. You lost to a team who then who then lost to UTSA. UTSA. Most people don't even know that's college. Then you get destroyed by Virginia. Sorry, Brett Bielema. You are still who we thought you were, which is not a good coach, unfortunately. The next thing we learned is it's possible to beat Ohio State unless you're Jim Harbaugh. Oregon got his first win ever over Ohio State. That means they beat them before Michigan's Jim Harbaugh's teams, which plays them every year, right? Jim Harbaugh plays them every year. Can't get the dub. Oregon went into the big house and got it done. Good for them. Next thing, Tennessee is back just to where we thought they were or where they were last year at least. Nowhere. Nowhere. Rocky Top, I feel bad for you. You've got a great theme song, great atmosphere, great crown. This is not a great football team. Rutgers is 2-0. I'll just leave that there. Iowa State is overrated once again. Not that good. Purdy, whatever. Also, can we, can we talk about this for a second? If you're going to wear the all blacks, which they look good, I guess, change your school colors. Just change your school colors. No one likes your school colors. You don't like your school colors. We don't like your school colors, Iowa State. Just change them. Just change them and be done. You can have a black cyclone, a black and white cyclone, or whatever, or black, white, and throw in a, what's that, maroon? I don't know, some kind of gold. Throw that in there, but add black to the logo. Make it more prominent. Let's go with it. The next thing is Georgia's act offense can actually score touchdowns. Okay, that's, that's a little aggressive. I, I apologize. And the final thing is USC. Sheesh. Stanford beat them 42-28. 42 to 28. Now, I know what you're thinking. Well, Stanford's good. Stanford got run 24 to 7 by Kansas State. 24 to 7 by Kansas State. This is not 1999. This is not 2000. 24 to 7 by Kansas State is an embarrassment. And USC got run 42 to 28. That's what we learned this week in college football. What did you learn about your team? Let me know in the comments below.